Okay, folks, this should be the last demo for the day, I'm hoping. Um, hopefully it is. I have, I have someone coming around this afternoon, so I don't want to be caught up trying to catch up because I missed a demo, because sometimes I do, and I do fuck it up. So I'm a bit shaky, folks. I get nervous. Fuck, I get nervous. Now, what am I doing here, folks? Yeah, I'm really missing a lost loved one, folks, called Luigi. And I'm trying to get in touch with him through the 6 o'clock uh, news. And it's proven to be more difficult than I ever imagined when I was starting out ten ye more than 10 years ago. So I started making videos and uploading them to social media like YouTube and Facebook. Well, especially YouTube. Facebook didn't have very good video uh, functionality it was mainly YouTube and yeah that was my beginnings anyway this is what we're demoing with who what where magazine or who magazine as it's really known as got these ugly looking plasticky celebrities that we're extreme makeover what fucking tards these are these idiots stupid people Yeah, that's come up looking quite interesting. Uh, I do wonder if we're going to try another one. This black looks shit house. The only thing black I want is my budget, is my my telco bills being in the black. I'd like to see my bills go in the black instead of being in the red, which they have been lately because I've been so there's been a high cost of living and electricity bills going up and power and and telco bills I need to keep going with even though I'm living on a very tight budget it was always a tight budget but it's just gotten worse with all these other expenses on our hands like power bills going up and I've just finished my winter use of the heat the use of the heater and the heater just got put away early this morning so hopefully I won't need that fucking thing ever again and this has come out looking nice, even though her face is... Dude, there's her face there. I don't know. But it's really proven to be difficult trying to keep make ends meet. I mean, most people are having problems anyway in some way, shape or form with budget, budgeting. But it's really hard for a person like myself because I'm trying to... Um, Use, use social media and, and technology en masse. I really need to use this stuff uh, to help get my word out, to get in touch with my lost partner, Luigi. And you know what love is like, folks. Love is an extremely powerful thing. And, you know, you need everyone needs it, and I need it, and I can't find it anywhere else but with Luigi. So I really need to get in touch with him. Otherwise, I'll die of a broken heart. So I have to do all this hard work on the social media and the TV networks and all that sort of shit. It's really difficult. It's proven to be very hard, but I'm trying my best. And I'm disabled, which makes things hard because I'm not able to earn much money. I'm not an earner. I'm not a big money earner. I can't do it, folks, with my disabilities um, it's impossible uh, it's impossible folks I mean trying to make these make the books balance you know trying to keep yourself from going into too much redness uh, when it comes to bills and shit it's really something to, to be believed seen to be believed folks when you're talking bills And I'm not rich, folks. I am far from it. I'm probably very lowly. I'm a lo I call myself lowly. 
as in lowly, as in low, a low person, a person that doesn't have much, uh, much status. My father treats me like I'm a lowly worm. He hates me, and I hate him. And I'm, I'm also trying to get in touch with. I'm trying to um, teach him that that this photocopier art is not foolishness. That it's indeed creativity and it's art and he won't believe me until I show some signs of success he's a real merit type guy even though he's a mediocre type of a person he believes it's better to to come out doing something mediocre than to fail than to have an outright apparent appearance of failure he hates failure to the point where he wants to avoid it at all costs, even if it means just being mediocre, just being average. He doesn't have any idea that you got to be, you can't just do things like that. Dad thinks, Dad goes, sorry, I'm talking through my ass again, but basically my dad can't sing and he joined, he's joined a group called Sing Australia for people who apparently love to sing and I'm getting a phone call I don't know what the fuck this number is it could be a fucking scam artist for all I know I hope not I might have to ring it back and see but I just hope it's not a scammer because uh, you get these scam calls on these odd f mobile numbers that you get and I don't like this image that much um, but yeah my dad just doesn't seem to have any idea that that it's best that you gotta you gotta go for broke, you know, you gotta keep going at it folks. You can't just give up. Just because the world tells you to give up, just because your father doesn't believe in you. You know, he doesn't just because oh, he's just an idiot. My dad is a bully and a teaser. I put him in the same category as the people that I dealt with at school who really rumbled me so badly at school and ruined my life and ruined my relationship with my brother as well because they weren't just happy with teasing me as soon as my brother went to the same high school that I went to he fucking got treated like shit and now my brother and I I'm at I'm at loggerheads with him now I don't get on with my brother because of these cunts you know they've ruined my fucking relationship with my brother I haven't got a fucking friendship or any sisterhood and brotherhood with my with my own sibling because these fucktards from school thought they'd pick on him as well because of me so he, these bitches can go fuck themselves and I fucking hope they burn in hell for doing this to my brother and I and ruining our fucking relationship well I fucking hate their guts I fucking hate them God now what has God got to do with this if God was real would he have allowed this rift to happen between me and my brother because of some fucktards who wanted to tease and bully him at, at, on account of me? Why? Why did these bitches do it, folks? Why? Why did they want to do that? Why couldn't they just pick on me? If they wanted to pick on someone, why couldn't they just pick on me only? Yes, I'm talking to you fucktards from Kalani Heights High School in particular. You can go fuck yourselves because I'm going to be a success and I'm going to fucking give you the middle finger and say, fuck yous for fucking up my relationship with my brother. I can't talk to my brother. I treat him like my dad. He's just, he's just a pain in the ass now. My brother's a useless fucking sibling. Um, I wish I didn't have him sometimes. Or I have done in the past. Wish, wish that. Um, even wished he died of, a, of an asthma attack when he was a kid. I, I have wished that that he died of an asthma attack because he had an asthma attack and it could have killed him but it didn't and I really wished it could have because we just didn't get on very well anyway this is not the greatest but hey it's not too bad I think we can now call this demo quits